Hi, today we will be talking about the three laws of motion. These three laws of motion were designed by 17th century English scientist Isaac Newton. Here are the three laws of motion, inertia, acceleration, and interaction. The first law, which is inertia, states that an object at rest will remain at rest until a force is acted upon it and an object in motion will continue to be in motion until a force stops it. Let me show you an example. You see that? That was a portion for static inertia which is the part where an object at rest will remain at rest until a force is acted upon it. Let me show you dynamic inertia, which is the other part. See, the book stopped it. Now let me tell you about friction stopping it. You see, friction stopped this mater toy. And that's why it just abruptly stopped. Let me tell you about the second law of motion. The second law of motion is the law of acceleration. It states that the acceleration of an object will be directly proportional to the force applied on it and inversely proportional to the mass of the object. Let me show you the formula for acceleration. Acceleration equals force divided by mass. Let me show you a real life example, an experiment. Did you hear that? When May McQueen was trying to push Mater, McQueen was still on the stage and there was no falling sound. But when it was Mater's turn to push McQueen, it fell off the table. You all heard that, right? Now, the third, on to the third law of motion. The third law of motion is the law of, every, of interaction. It states that for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Let me show you an example. You see, the diving board, which is the ruler over here, it bended when M McQueen jumped because of the law of interaction. Thank you. Bye-bye.